Hey guys, welcome to round one. It's uh, Craig and Peter here. Uh, I kept seven on the play and Craig has kept six on the draw. That's right. All right, and I'll start off with a forest tap for Sentinel Pass. Right on. Unclaimed territory, name human. Recruitment officer. Right. Go ahead. All right. Uh, I'm going to shock in Overgrown Tomb. Mm -hmm. Tap for Leaf Crown, and then tap these two for another Sentinel yep. pass. Place Clue to Courtyard, name Human. Um, and he's a 2 3 now, right? Yes. Oh, let's just do it. Pay two for Denik. Okay. Um, and pass. This elf ball is going to get me. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, let's play land. What up, nerds? And All right, round, round one. It's Matt. There's Bayard Gilex. Mm hmm. Sorry, I'm just trying to think of how this is going to work out. I always get like anxious when I'm like taking... I, I, I'm not even taking that long on my turn. Uh, let's just do... This. Play another Leaf Crown. Uh, pass. Play a boulder loft pathway. Pay one for a hopeful initiate. Yep. Two for values lieutenant. Yep. It's time for the counters. Here they come. <laughs> Move to combat. Yep. Swing for six. Uh, how much toughness? That's just three so it's two. a three two. And a three four. Uh, a block with a 3 4 here. Just, oh, okay. And, yep. Ah, yep. And then and I take, take three, 3, and do you gain 3? And I will gain 3. Where is Mom Dice? There it is. Yep. Forgot about the Your second leaf. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was wondering. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. Uh, and I'll pass. End of turn. I'm going to tap this. This is 1, well, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't. <laughs> It's like, I have so few ways to All right, and then turn. I'll go down to two, play Coco. Yep. Yeah, there's, there's like four cards in the end. <laughs> right. All right. I did, I did start off by saying, Garrison, you're Let's going to scrub. Leaf Leave Crown Visionary yeah. and Shaman. Yep. And uh, trigger, I'll draw first. All right, and then yeah, this I is uh, one, two, three, three four, five, one. six damage. We'll go yeah, to seventeen. Yeah. And then Let's... take my turn. Mm -hmm. Let me organize just a little bit here. Something I still haven't quite learned how to do well is organize my board. The board say it gets crazy real fast. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Trying to figure out if I have what I need to do this. Dude, I'm loving this so much, you have no idea. I mean, of course you have the stage. Uh, this is just a... Just a 2-3. Just a 2-3. Let's just swing. So this is currently a 5-4. Right, that's 2. 
and this is currently a 3-4. So I'm just going to swing with these two. I will take 8, go to 9. Alright, and then... Uh, Alright, let me tap for mana. So I'm going to tap Nick though, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 mana. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So if you play a land, and, and just, I'm going to cord yeah. uh, for uh, six, yeah, so, so two left. Let's grab. Oh, you're saying to make it a two-two, yeah. yeah. If that would put me at one left. Shaman of the pack? Uh, yeah. Uh, you have it, how much is that already on the board? One, two, three, four, yeah. five, so six, seven. So we'll and Swamp. how much mana do I have left? Two. I'm going to find... Mm. How does that happen? Because I have a reward. Yeah, I think I can do this. Um, okay, so you don't have the grazer, but everything and then else is literally cuts. Perfectly. Nah, so you're good. Another, Alright, and then. Uh, do I need to play both? Yeah. Take one, two, three, four, take five, seven. six, seven. Yep. And then I have two mana floating still, and I can tap one, two, three, four, five. So that's seven. Uh, I'm going to play another chord. Yep. Right on. Let's uh, go to game two. Yep. <laughs> I was trying to figure out if I could do that or not. It seemed to work. So. You were showing because Fatal Push is basically dead in this matchup because I don't have a choice to and I know that he's running something. Hmm. I don't know if anything on my sideboard like actually really does anything against you, like anything helpful. I don't know if there's anything on my sideboard I want. I can think of a few things in my deck I don't want. <laughs> Still don't really know what you're playing in your deck, so. I know there's like some tricks with like quarter calling where you can like cast it, grab your thing, and while that's still on the stack, you like grab another elf with another cord because it's at instant speed. <laughs> so then like the shaman triggers do more damage. Oh, like before he resolves, cast the cord and go get more. Yeah. Yeah. I see what you're doing there. That's cool. There, I don't think I was able to do it. Be mm, I don't know. I guess because that's an ETB effect that, like, the creature's still on the field. So, like, before the trigger resolves, I could tap it for another cord. I mean, if I drew a land, I had... That, I, yeah. I think so. Yeah, because he enters, it goes on the stack. And it would have so to happen then. I think that works. I put that new uh, Planeswalker in my sideboard. Uh, the Tyvar Planeswalker. Oh, right on. I still don't know if it's going to be any good in this deck. It didn't matter. I didn't like what it. is his ultimate? Uh, so his passive ability is creatures can tap for activated abilities as if they had haste. Mm -hmm. uh, plus one is untap target creature you control, and then minus two is mill two cards, put uh, a creature card with mana value two or less uh, onto the battlefield. Oh, okay. So... Yeah. Yeah, I can see where. It, it just seems like a little, like I feel like you just have to build a new deck. Like you wouldn't be able to play like the as many like quarter callings or cocos with it. It might be a little, yeah, clunky in your deck. I feel. Um, it's like I feel like it dilute what you're trying to do. Yeah. Well, you or like make it's a such a fast card. board state. It's yeah. like the ability to what get it to. Get a two drop. It's like you don't really need that. Yeah, exactly. Um, I don't know. I guess it depends on the the. It, I would hey, leave it in there for now and 
after a week or two if you've never brought it in a single matchup and cut it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, true. Yeah. Because there, there might be tricky. something that you're like, oh, this actually ends up being good here. Yeah. Yeah, sideboarding is like really difficult. <laughs> I will take the play. Sounds good. Well, the problem with this deck is that my mana is even worse post board. <laughs> Got it. Nice. <laughs> I'm curious. See if we get a little action this time. Do you like Denik? Uh, yeah, he's okay. Um, it is really good because it protects your graveyard. It does it. Uh, what uh, does it, it do? So exactly? it, you can't. Tar uh, player things in graveyards can't be the target of spells or abilities. Oh, so you can't exile my graveyard. But it also, if he dies, can come back as the spirit, which Got it. is nice for a board wipe. And then it's just kind of lifelink. Um, I haven't played with him a ton, so I don't know if I actually like him. Is he only flying on his spirit yes. side? Yes. I thought about it. Time to play. Let's oh, see. Man. Oh. Um, I'm going to try this. I think same. So I'm All right. to keep it. Uh, let's shock in a pool. Play experiment one. Go ahead. So like if you have... Can I read it? Yeah, absolutely. Cast. Evolve. Uh, He's got a ton of text. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. Regenerate. All right, uh, I'm just gonna play layer and pass. Oh, that hurts, but we have to do it. Boulder Loft Pathway. Values, Lieutenant. Okay. Go to combat. Yep. Swing for two. I'll take it. And pass. Not the two drop you want to play after. <laughs> yeah, probably not with that. No. Get some more value off of something else. Uh, I'll play Blooming Marsh, mm -hmm. and I will play Elvish Warmaster. Right on. Uh, you're go. Okay. I'm a little worried about like, I don't know. If, I feel like you'd probably be playing like yeah. Skyclave or something. Uh, not in this deck. Unclaimed territory. Ooh, excuse me. Name human. I'm gonna play Brutal Cathar. Pay three for Aether Channeler. Oh, okay. Not Brutal Cathar. Um, when he enters, we will make a bird. Okay. And trigger on the lieutenant. Yep. Uh, go to combat. I think this levels up two from that, right? No, because it has to have greater power or toughness. And since he's already got the counter, oh yeah, because he's two. Yeah. yeah. Okay, sorry. Uh, go to combat. Swing four. I'll take it. And say go. All right, uh, I will play Nykthos, and I will tap two for Dwinnin's Elite, mm -hmm. trigger, two triggers, I'm gonna lose two, from drawing two, two elf tokens. To Wait, and those aren't elves. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, and then... I will play a just bar a sentinel right now and say go. Okay. Mm, play forest. Pay four to Coco. Yep. Yeah. Please not be scary. Four, five, six. We're gonna get what? Aether Channeler I know. and Adeline. Okay. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> Little bit. Um, when the Channeler enters, we're gonna make a second bird. Yep. And then two counters, so yep. two, three. Um, and it pumps him because of Adeline. Yep. 
then let's. They don't. Have, none of them have plus one, plus one, do they? No. Nope. Okay, then we are gonna move to combat. Human token. Yes. That's a bird. <laughs> there. Trigger there. And so that is three, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yep. I'm gonna block here. I will block here. Here. And I'll block the human here. Okay. And then uh, how much is and so I guess I'll five. I'll oh. jump here. And then before damage. I'm going to cord for two. Right on. Grabbing Leaf Crown Visionary. <laughs> yeah. Trigger War Master. So, so these two trade. Two. Those will trade. Yeah. These will trade. This is a two-two now. Oh yes. So he's dead. Uh, this is chumping. So this is dead. And then this, this kills dies. that. This and then does. yep. And I think that's correct. Right up. All right. And I'll take nothing. My okay. Because you chumped him. Oh yep, chump. Yeah. All right. Untap. Go ahead. Oh, this trade. These two trade. That's right. Oh yes. I think that was the first one we said. Yeah. <laughs> okay. On to draw. So it's my deck backwards. I think it is. Yeah. Alright. Uh. Yeah, if you grab two Fable Passages, it's extra damage. In this case, it's extra light damage. Uh, yeah, I'm going to play this and pay one to draw. Mm -hmm. uh, trigger. Mm -hmm. And play both Seiju's land. How many cards on hand? Two. And this just came in. These two just came in. I would think it will. Because it will I don't know, man. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to rely on the million cards and we don't have the draw. Right. I think I'll just pass. Okay. <clears throat> Same time. Let's so that's play our land for turn. And you're gonna play the, the land from hand, I assume. Well, we'll finish this. Yeah. 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 So that's so eight triggers. Yep. Pay uh, four. Cast Coco. Oh God. I would like them to be. I would, I would like them to all be drain light. Yes. I would like to point. We're going to Three take a brutal Cathar. Okay. And a Manus Rider. Ooh. Okay. What does Manus Rider do? Uh, he's a 3-3 three, three with Flying Vigilance and Haste. Got it. Uh, when Cathar enters, we will take, take Visionary. this dude. Yep. And then two counters um, here. Yep. Let's move to combat. And Vigilance is a swing with this, this, and this. This uh, trigger make a human counter. That's a bird again. Jeez. <gasps> the human is also swinging. Got it. All right, I'm gonna jump here, block here. Uh, that's just swinging the air, right? Mm -hmm. And then let's the whole block here. Okay. Uh. And before damage, I'm gonna cord. Mm -hmm. uh, 
for two. Right on. Might not be relevant, but in case it is, it is now day. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's see. It'd be nice to find my card. All right. This dies, these trade, mm -hmm. uh, trigger from Warmaster, get another yep. one of these. Uh, that dies. And you take three? Yep, I'll take three. Eleven. Oh, that's yours, I'm sorry. Yep. <laughs> okay. Interesting and game. Pass. Alright. <laughs> Coco cord. Coco cord. <laughs> <laughs> This is a very interesting game. Um, man, this is a tricky situation. All right, let's just start with the tap, play elf, mm -hmm. and I'll tap another one to draw. Yeah. Uh, trigger. What? Uh, then I'll tap this. To tap Nick those for one, two, three, four, five, six. And I will play. Oh, let me get a dice here. Mm -hmm. I'll tick a down one to play another elf. Tick down to draw. Mm -hmm. uh, then I'll tick down two. Play Warmaster, mm -hmm. and I'll tick down one to draw. And uh, trigger the other one. Right? Uh, nope. Uh, that only triggers once per turn. Oh. Yeah, the sequencing is a little goofy. Because, uh, yeah, like it would have been nice to have that before drawing the other one. Right, right. Uh, I don't think I can do much else this turn, so uh, I'll just play tap land and say go. Okay. Play a land for turn. Pay four. Oh my god. <laughs> is that three Cocos this it game? It is. Oh boy. The grind is real. Yeah. Um, so we're going to get... Wow. I just pulled seven cards. Oh. And this was the last one. Got it. So we're going to put him... Shuffle anyways after. Oh, okay. Damn it, I really or, wanted that card. Too. Oh. Because <laughs> it would oh, go. Actually, let's ask Matt what we should do. Yeah. I guess you don't shuffle from Coco. Matt. What? I accidentally pulled an extra card on Coco. Nice. So I looked at the top seven. Do you know which was the seven? Yes. It's okay. currently on top so of my you deck. You should not know that information so that your deck should be shuffled, but if you stride anything to the bottom, that should stay there. Okay, so before I put these other ones back on bottom, I should shuffle my deck. Yes. Gotcha. Yes. That makes sense. All right, we'll do that first. Okay. Fair <laughs> enough. I was like, yeah, top seven, oh. great. <laughs> As if I didn't just Coco twice uh, before. Shoot, 
It's been a week, man. <laughs> it's, it's been a week you for a long time. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay. Um, so I'm going to take Brutal uh, the no. okay. recruitment officer and a mana strike. Okay. It's not the worst thing that could happen. Oh, more um, big Thalia. More triggers. Yeah, if I just had Trample, that'd be great. Yeah. Um, then we will move to combat. Yep. And let's swing for... Jesus, what the hell is that? 10? 16? All right, well, we're, we're chomping there. I'll be taking six in there. Oh, okay. Uh, well... That I'm just trying to think in my head whether or not yeah. I want to take that this turn. Or... I assume you have another core. Yeah, yeah, you know, I just have them all. <laughs> I just figured, I was like, you're going to tap all your elves and cast another thing. <laughs> Let's... Yeah, I guess I'll just take and go down to five. So okay. I'll take the six in there and this dice. Uh, right on. And I'm hellbent. Pass. All right. Need something good. It's like I have like a lot of cards on board right now. So. Let's. And I did it on my turn. See one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Because that would be the card yeah, on top of your library. It was Dread Presence. But if I waited, it was Tantus. Tap this for 8. 100% of the time. Uh, and uh, let's play... Do you want to draw a card? Go down. Do you want to draw a card? Well, let's just say that's... Uh, or, yeah, uh, 6. Mm -hmm. Leave Crown Visionary. Mm -hmm. And then I'll go to 5 and draw. I don't. You don't. Why? I gain 2. Then let's... I mean, I guess if you draw Fatal Push. Really Play second yeah, Nykthos. Really 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 I think the, the upside is... Uh, and then it's let's down you. tick this to three to tap Nykthos to mm -hmm. make one, two, three, four, three. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So uh, the, this actually triggered twice from the yep. two Leaf Crowns. So, so we're at 13. Because I know there's cards in this deck that it hits the fifth. Uh, it where's 13? <laughs> but like, none of those are. And let's down tick this are. to 11. We'll tap Looming Marsh for black. We'll play Shaman of the Pack. Yep. So that, and then we'll ta tick this down two times to draw twice. Mm -hmm. uh, so, trigger. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve damage. Yeah, put me to eight. And then let's tick this down to seven. Tap this for black and play second shaman. Nice, right? Oh on, my dude. god. Good, <laughs> Good game. 